On this Millennial Review, we're taking a look at this 3-in-1 tripod selfie stick and even remote capture system. Let's go ahead and check this thing out. I'll let you know what I think about it and uh, yeah, let's check it out. So this is straight off of Amazon. So this is just called a 3-in-1 selfie stick. You look at the Amazon link right there and you'll notice that it's really just a 40 inch extendable tripod. Now the real neat thing about this is this tripod comes set up with a mount for your phone, but you can also set this up to where it would actually work with a regular camera as well. So go ahead and drop my phone out of there, but you'll notice it's actually got a pretty nice uh, holder for your cell phone. Now this does unscrew off the top of, uh, of the tripod and what you'll see is this actually has a pretty neat fold action to it. You can see the legs all fold together and the whole thing compresses down. Now this actually ends up being really quite small. You'll see that uh, we'll get a tape measure and you'll notice when it's all folded up, uh, this thing comes in just shy of seven and a half inches. So it's not very uh, very tall, and it's also uh, not super thick. At the thickest point, you know, we're talking still about two and a half inches, uh, which means the setup is really not bad at all. The other neat thing uh, that I really like about this is with your cell phone holder screwed right back onto the top here. So we'll screw that uh, that guy right back on. You'll notice we can lock that into place. If you screw this down, you'll notice that it's actually gonna all entirely fold up together. So it ends up being a really compact, really small uh, package to carry around. Uh, I really like how this all folds up. Now what's really neat, of course you can rotate this up. You've got a little lock for the ball heads. You can do tilt, you can do all sorts of, uh, of angles to it. But if you spread out the legs, it can sit pretty small just like that not not too big but it can actually extend to be 40 inches long so we're not going to be able to get all this in the shot but uh, you can actually see it ends up being a really long selfie stick and a neat thing about it is going to be the included remote so this comes with a remote this is bluetooth it's just got a small on off switch there but you can actually pop the remote in upside down if you want to protect it from getting hit. You can flip it over and it actually has a cutout to be able to turn it on and off. And then you could have your phone out way in front of you and be able to, uh, to hit that capture button. Now, the other neat thing is because this is stepped, uh, I can actually set it up to where with the legs down on this, you can see that we can still have uh, the whole mount there. We can slide it down as we want to, and it ends up being a really versatile mount. Now, it's pretty sturdy. It's, uh, it's not nearly as plasticky as I was expecting. I mean, this item on Amazon there, when I bought it, was about $20, so it's not super expensive. But you can see that the legs are all held on uh, by these screws, so that means you can actually tighten it up as you need to. The hardware for this ball head adjustment is not the world's most durable, but, uh, but it definitely seems to work. I suspect this is gonna last a little while, um, but again, at $20, it's not too crazy. But uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and we'll put that back together. So now on the phone, the phone mount works pretty well. So we saw it kind of folds up just like that. You can fold it back, but uh, we'll unscrew it and you'll see that it's actually gonna mount up uh, really pretty easy. Uh, and I, I definitely like that feature. So now let's go ahead and use the box as something to be able to take a picture of. So we're gonna go ahead and just open up the camera app here. And you'll notice that we can now use uh, the included ball head mount and we can adjust this. You know, my phone's giving us the angle. So let's go ahead and try to get that over to be zero and now we can actually take our remote and let's turn this on so I'm gonna pull this down pull this down here see if we can't uh, 
see if we can get the Bluetooth to go on. So Bluetoothing on. Let's see. It says two Bluetooth devices. That's because it's going to have uh, both my uh, Bluetooth stereo there. But so we've actually got the little remote for this mount. So let's go ahead and hop right back into the cameras. So we'll bring the camera right back up and you'll notice by hitting this, it's gonna take photos. The other really neat thing I like about it is it's actually set up to where it can record too. So you can get some recording and you can just start and stop. So that's pretty neat. Remote turns right off. So we're back there, nothing's gonna happen. I'll turn the remote back up. The pairing is actually super quick, just flashed because it's paired now, and boom, we got photos again. And this is gonna work in all the different modes, at least on my, my Android here. I suspect on an iPhone it would work that way too. And it's gonna take some nice pictures. Now the neat thing I like about this ball head mount is you can actually take the ball head Go all the way down like that and then let's go ahead and actually flip the phone and now you can take portrait modes as well so let me zoom down here you'll see that's actually how it's set up I can actually raise this up and uh, it's gonna work out pretty well so I'm gonna just push this forward and show you the next really neat feature that I like about it so we can actually now rotate this down and uh, you can actually see that this is gonna be a good tripod uh, should you want one to actually be able to do some unboxing videos. So let's go ahead and go into video there. You can hit video and then now you'll actually see it's in a pretty good position to be able to check out uh, this entire package you can notice even with me moving stuff around, the tripod is pretty sturdy. And if we zoom out, you'll notice, I mean, you can get pretty far away from this object. I'm gonna pull it all the way up. You'll notice this is way high up there, but so we'll scroll back down and you can actually see just how far away that is. This is my hand. So that 40 inches in length is a pretty cool setup. I definitely like the way that this is set up and then of course you know we can zoom right in and you'll see just stop recording so it ends up working pretty well so that's a look at this tripod system from Amazon not uh, not too expensive sort of uh, a just general make of a three-in-one tripod selfie stick it's a, it's a pretty neat rig for the money for sure so go ahead and let me know your thoughts on this uh, this $20 tripod, this 40 inch selfie stick. Let me know if this is something you'd be interested in. Could you see this working? You know, what, what are your thoughts? As well as be sure to let me know what you'd love to see in the next video. I might be able to make it happen.